Hey besties, welcome to Bare Face Monday Review. That is way too long of a title. Pretty much what I'm trying to say is I'm going to do reviews with no makeup on because um, I don't wear makeup 24-7 and you know, we need to let our skin breathe and feel beautiful without any face on. So I'm going to talk to you without having any fuck charm today. Woohoo! <laughs> so today I just wanted to speak on AliExpress brushes. Now I know... AliExpress brushes, why would you want to buy that from there? Well, it's actually a pretty good investment in the sense of price and um, price <laughs> and honestly quality of brushes that you will receive depending on which brushes you purchase. Now I have a few tips on buying AliExpress brushes and I'm also going to show you the sets or individual brushes that I purchased. Now I first want to start off with the individu individual brushes that I first purchased. This one is the Flat Top Kabuki. Now I thought this would come in a four set but they didn't specify on the headline that it would be one brush alone. But nonetheless this is a pretty good quality brush. I use this for my concealer. So I use this for my under eye concealer and it blends it really nicely. Um, I didn't pay probably no more than two to three dollars for this brush. So winning on that um, Now this is the one that took forever to come when you're looking at these brushes and they seem to come at us in a set You definitely need to read through the whole page to make sure um, That you're receiving the brush you want because when it comes to individual brushes and they're showing you a full set they will state a little tiny part <laughs> that you choose which brush you want and I wasn't aware of that and I a lot of people actually once I read the reviews didn't realize that you have to pick a certain brush so they just automatically send me this I then received this set and this is the mineral makeup set I'm definitely gonna link all the stories down below so that way you can find these things really quick now this is a set of 10 brushes I am I don't have one right now but what you receive and this set is an eyebrow as an angled liner brush, a angled eyeshadow brush, a larger um, kabuki brush, and you also receive a smaller smaller size one, so a half size of this, um, an eyeshadow or concealer brush, a foundation, a little kabuki thingy majiggy, which is awesome for um, blending out your under eye concealer or setting your concealer or even balm for contouring right here um, a smudge brush a crease brush which you know a lot of kits don't tend to come with crease brushes so that's what definitely drew me to this they give you tons of options and you can do your whole face with just this one brush set so I think this is a really good investment and then you get a powder brush which I can you can also use to put on your foundation contour all the, the whole nine yards with this one brush so for this set I have spent no more than 11 to 13 dollars on it and dude that's like a really good buy the shipping didn't take long nor do I ever pay for shipping because the shipping can be very expensive so if they're charging you shipping ixnay there are tons of stores on aliexpress that um sell the same exact things the sense of these sets you do receive a good amount of brushes for a really good price this set was maybe 10 11 dollars <gasps> yeah and one two three four five six seven Eight brushes and I feel like I'm missing one I'm not sure if I got nine yep I got nine so these are the brushes that you get an eyeliner brush another little kabuki thingy like this great for contouring um, a larger crease brush a shadow brush an, an angled brush another one of these contouring brushes a flat liner brush a shadow brush and I'm assuming a little powder brush because that's what I use for put my under eye powder did I mention the price did I tell you guys that this was only like $11 like oh not only that but they apply my makeup so nicely I just I was actually really in shock but super excited when I received these um no these are really good great investment um out of all the brushes that I will be speaking of today um these specific ones with the same color 
are the ones I would go for. If you're looking at these brushes and you're like, oh, I wanna buy a set, I would go for these brushes. And then within the same route of the brushes I just previously showed you, I also ordered these brushes. Now these brushes all come from the same store and the store offers awesome other brushes, but these must be their most popular set. Now, don't get me wrong, they might start going up in price. I hopefully they don't, because this is what attracts to people. You're getting good brushes for an inexpensive price. Now, these were maybe um, 12, to, I think they were 12 to $13. I purchased the two sets together, even though they're two separate sets, and my total came out to $23. So you receive a, I like to use this for foundation. It applies it so nicely. like. It makes it gives you like a super pretty airbrush look you'll see because I'm be doing video with these brushes obviously so like a foundation contouring buffing brush in a sense a large powder brush um, another oh another foundation brush ish um, a smaller maybe blush brush and another like blush brush Whatever you want to use them for, you can def switch it up. It doesn't have to be specifically for that, you know, part of your face. So, girls, check these puppies out. Check out AliExpress. Now, along with speaking about the brushes that I just showed you, I also want to give you a few tips on how I purchase brushes off of AliExpress so you get the best deal possible. Tip number one is do your research on AliExpress. When I say that, I mean when you click on a page, there are a tons of things you need to look at. One, always read the reviews. Some, if they don't have reviews on their products, I wouldn't purchase from them to be honest, because you're, it's not showing. It's not showing that other people have purchased from them as well. So if they have a lot of reviews, read through all of the reviews. If there's a consistently bad review, like they're saying the same things over and over that aren't good, like long shipping and um, or the quality of the brushes being bad, stick to those bad reviews because those are the people who are being honest and they are telling you, no, they're not as good as everyone makes them seem. So definitely want to read the reviews. Um, tip number two is on the right side there is a bar of the store itself and they have a percentage of how good the store is just like eBay right so you want I personally don't like to go no less than 98% also you don't want to pay for shipping shipping is too expensive to ship from China to here so and most of the items off of Aliexpress offer you free shipping when you're searching something off of Aliexpress you will have all these like little bars and boxes on the top and you're like why do they have all this stuff here are the top things i suggest you click on when it comes to that top bar maybe i can insert a picture um you want to put top rated you want to make sure you want to also click on number of orders making sure the number of orders is the highest you know Want it to go from the highest to lowest, and um, what else? Uh, what else? and you want to click on free shipping, so you make sure you receive free shipping as well. Um, I like to go by order numbers and being top rated because it's an obvious indication that a lot of people are purchasing this item, and then you'll get few, um, you'll get a lot of reviews on the item itself. Also, write to the companies as well if they're. If you're feeling iffy about purchasing item write to the person before see how their communication is with you if they're not responding quick enough explain them. that's the end of the video I hope you guys enjoyed it I hope this helps someone out there let me know if you purchase anything off of Aliexpress I would love to see what you guys get and um, that's it baby dolls just make sure you do your research and keep an eye out that's all so thank you guys so much for watching this video see you guys next time Stay blessed, guys. Bye.